Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I'm gonna start this video off by saying I hate cleaning with a passion. I hate cleaning. It is a never ending job. There is always cleaning to be done and I don't know where it comes from. I don't feel like I'm a messy person, but apparently, apparently I am because it's just, it's always there. I hate it. I thought I'd try and make it a little bit more fun for myself and test some TikTok cleaning products. So. I have a little pile in front of me of products that I've seen used on TikTok to help clean, like cleaning hack type things. We're gonna test them. We're gonna hope, fingers crossed, they help me out a little bit because I just don't want to clean anymore. I don't want to, but if these things make it slightly fun, slightly easier, I'll take it. So without further ado, let's test some products. I'm gonna just grab one. So we're gonna start off pretty darn simple little glove. Um, apparently, you put this on your hand, you wipe down surfaces and just all of the dust just comes to your hand and stays on your hand. That's the bit I'm questioning. I feel like some of it will go into the air and then when I leave the room it will nestle back down. But we're gonna test this, so this says it's a high performance dusting glove. Not just any old dusting glove, it's a high performance dusting glove. <laughs> okay, the instructions on this are on point. How to use, number one, wipe surface. That's it. <laughs> End of how to use section, all done. Right, so we're just wiping the surface and that is quite literally it. Daily rinse and wring out after use. So we're just wiping and then when we're done, we're gonna wash it, wring it out and use it again. Sounds incredible. It's also Good Housekeeping 2020 approved. I don't know if that's a really good thing or just a sales tactic, but it's Good Housekeeping approved. Oh, it, is it just me or do these both look like thumbs? Glove is on, let's go clean. This is the most annoying work surface we have. No, it's not a work surface, it's just a surface. It gets so dusty and I de-dust this thing all the time, still dusty. Have a look, can you see the dust? I don't know if the camera will pick up on the dust. This would save me a lot of time if this works. Can I just, <gasps> oh my goodness. I am loving every second of this. <gasps> Look at that. And it's staying on the glove. That's the bit I'm most impressed with. Normally I'll wipe the surface and dust will just get left behind. There is no dust left behind. Let's just get under here. Just. Ugh. I'm slightly embarrassed. <laughs> this is vile. No one should be living like this. <laughs> it just keeps going. It's just, it's just collecting everything. Dee, 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 dee. Right, this is um, gross. Also, I feel like kind of embarrassing. However, I have dusted that. Lots of that, I get the hoover on it. I get wipes on it. This just, this is magic. And the dust is on my hand. Normally, I'll wipe it and I'll leave a bit behind and I'll wipe it again and I'll just spread the dust around. This, genius. And do you know how nice it is to just move your hand around into little crevices without having to hold onto a cloth? Although I will say, dust is in the air. Dust is popping off of it a little bit and going into the air, but generally, huge thumbs up. I'm gonna go wash this now. And after I finish this video, we'll be dusting the whole house because this, this is a find. Dee -dee -dee. Doo -doo -doo. La -dee -da -dee -da. This. Now, if this stuff works, lifesaver. I don't know about you, but now and again, I'll stick things places and then I'll take the sticker off and there's this stuff left behind and it will not come off. You can scrub it, you can scratch it, you can, it, it will not come off. It, and I don't really understand it because when I've stuck the sticker down, the sticker doesn't even seem that sticky but then the stuff that it leaves behind, G. Louise. So this is called Goo Gone. It's a trusted number one brand. I have heard of it before, have never used it. When I thought about getting this for this video, I thought, I don't really have anything at the moment that I can't get off. But then I remembered, downstairs in the kitchen, this is so random, underneath our cupboards, there's like, it, I think it's where the cupboards were maybe stuck together in transit, I'm not too sure, but underneath the cupboards 
in our kitchen, there are little strips of sticky stuff that will not come off and you can't see it, so I can't be bothered. I'm using all sorts of fun angles today. This is, wait, where is it? Here. Can you see this? Looks like a piece of tape was there when it was in transit maybe or something, but I scrubbed this and one, it's quite a hard angle to scrub anyway. You can't put force into it. It's sort of like a, it's really awkward, but I've tried to scrub this off and it doesn't come off very easily at all. We're gonna put this to the test because that is stuck on. The instructions are pretty simple. Apply this, wipe it, and then wash it with hot soapy water. That's kind of as far as this goes. Lift tab to open. I'm trying to lift the tab. I can't grab the tab. <laughs> This isn't easy. Okay, we've got the tab. Okay, we're open. <laughs> my elbow, <laughs> my elbow again. There is a little sheet across the top and there's a tiny little hole in the middle. Now, I feel like normally you would just pour this onto a surface. I can't really pour upwards and I don't really fancy shooting it upwards. So I'm gonna put a little bit onto this and rub it on. I don't know how much I need to put on. I feel like that's a decent amount. <gasps> is that coming off already? No. <gasps> <gasps> I'm barely putting any pressure on and it's just kind of rubbing away. What is this magic? I know I'm easily impressed. I get it. I'm a very easily impressed person, but this, I feel like even people who aren't easily impressed would be impressed with. This is, this is going through life with me. When I've got kids and they stick stickers everywhere, this. This is gonna be my holy grail. That's amazing. Got myself some cleaning slime. I will never grow up, I refuse. I will always enjoy slime and sticky stuff and putty and all of the things children enjoy. Me too. But put it in some adult packaging and pretend there's a good use for it. This is Universal Dust Cleaning Gel, also known as slime. So basically it's a little pot of slime and you just stick it places and it collects dust. I don't know how many times you can use it because it sounds like the dust is gonna build up pretty fast, but it's good for things like keyboards and keyboards. I don't know what else, printer machines. Ooh, we could try it on my printer. No idea when I last dusted my printer. Well, this is good, isn't it? They haven't given me a lip to get in. Why do products do this? There is no sticky out tabby thing to get this off. Why? Why? Let me in. You're gonna make me use my teeth, aren't you? Here we go. Why? I can't get in. Here we go. Okay, we're in. Ooh. Ooh. Hello. Oh, such a faint smell. That's why I'm taking such deep breaths, which I probably shouldn't. Probably shouldn't be putting this near my face, but smells so good. It smells kind of like, um, I think it's watermelon. I wanna say it's watermelon. Right, let's get this thing out. <gasps> oh, look, should we do some uh, ASMR? I'm not very good at ASMR, but I can try. Oh, it doesn't make any noise. It's good, isn't it? It doesn't make any noise at all. Oh yeah. Oh, I like this a lot. <laughs> This isn't for cleaning. This is for people to play with. When your boss comes in and goes, what are you doing? You go, oh, I'm just cleaning. That's what I'm, that's not a great noise. <laughs> I'm just cleaning with this, just cleaning. Um, no, you weren't. You were playing with your slime. This is some top quality slime. Look at this. Whoa. I'm gonna find something to clean and we're gonna de-dust with my dusting slime. Now, this computer isn't that old. In fact, it really shouldn't be that dusty, but I can kind of already see the dust. So I'm gonna just slobber this all over it and hope that the dust picks up. I'm just gonna just, should I turn it off first? I don't really wanna just slam this onto it and then stuff go wrong. Oh, look at the state of my screen. I need something to clean my screen. Look at all those fingerprint marks. Also, why are there fingerprint marks on my computer screen? When do I, it's not touch screen. Why am I, what the heck? Just gonna, See you there. Nothing much happens, to be honest. Why are you turning back on? I didn't ask for you to turn. I didn't ask you to turn on. 
<laughs> this is quite good. Looks a little like a, uh, one of those. <laughs> okay, my keyboard looks cleaner, but there doesn't seem to be much on here. You can see the dust on there, so you ready? Dust be gone. What about this plant? I don't know if you can see dust on there. There's dust galore. Just squidge this on there. <gasps> Amazing. Just for reference, that isn't a real plant. I don't just squash plants. That's not my thing. I'm now just looking around the room like, what can I shove slime into? Um, turns out not much. Look how cute she is, but look how dusty her head is. Now if we just... <gasps> That's quite lovely. Even though this thing now has a lot of dust in it, you can't even tell. She looks lovely and clean. What are you? <gasps> oh, they're so diddy! Oh my gosh, okay. I thought I was getting one giant one of these. Look how cute they are. That is so diddy. Now this, I'm a little unsure of because I've seen it being used and it seems like a genuine lifesaver for carpets and scraping up rubbish. But I've also seen people saying that you can damage your carpet. So I'm gonna test it, but I'm gonna be very, very gentle. And the reason I want this is because, hello, long hair, um, our carpets are just full of hair. My hair, don't have any pets, but still full of hair, because even if my hair is up, somehow I molt. I just walk along and just molt. I don't know how it happens. With my new little pal, I can just, shh, shh, ooh. Oh my gosh, why did I not test if that was even sharp first? It wasn't, but imagine if it was and I've just scraped it along myself. Don't do that. But luckily it's not sharp, so we're okay. Anyway, I'm gonna use this on our carpet and see the monstrosity of hair and grossness that it picks up that the Hoover just doesn't seem to. Welcome to the floor of my side of the bed. Um, this is where most of my hair fall is. I'm expecting to pick up quite a bit. I have just hoovered this area. I'm a little bit nervous, I'm not gonna lie. Look away now if you don't want to see a little pile of hair covered in dust. That's gross. That's after hoovering. I gave this a little hoover. That's after hoovering. That's what's left on just this little patch of floor. That's gross. Okay, this little patch hasn't just been hoovered. Oh. My. Whoa. Look at all that hair. Ew. This one I feel is the most popular on TikTok. I feel like if you've been on TikTok and you've seen cleaning TikToks, this will have been in it, almost guaranteed. I feel like this has almost become a little mini craze, but I also feel like we had this when I was younger. I genuinely have recollections of going to like an open air road show type thing and people demonstrating this and mum bought some and we blooming loved the stuff and then we couldn't find it anywhere in the shops. Now, we try and take real good care of our hob, so we scrub that thing. Um, which means there isn't anything on there to clean. So I found this tray. This tray is from the bottom of our oven and it doesn't really get cleaned very much. That sounds really bad, but it, we don't use it. So it doesn't really get cleaned. But as you can see, little bits have fallen onto it over time and it's got a little bit grubby. So we're gonna use some pink stuff and see what we can do. Ooh. Okay, it's a little bit more gooey than I remember it being. I remember it being a lot harder. Like you had to really scrape it to get some. This is a little bit softer than I remember. Let's see what this can do. It doesn't look like it can do much. I mean, it's doing a general good job, but this bit will not come off. What are you and why won't you leave? Okay, we're gonna get our smiley sponge involved. Let's do a little bit of this. This guy solves world problems. Boom. Look at the little twinkle in his eye. This little guy 
lifesaver. I love him. Little bit of a collaborative effort, I must say, but this little guy came into our life quite recently and this is a time saver. Honestly, the amount you need to scrub with this is so much more minimal than any other scourer I've ever tried ever. So this is quite good, it does give a little extra exfoliation, but these two together, I think these, these are a pair. I think you're gonna need to get them together. And if you can only get one of them, I'd maybe say this one, it's just, look at his little smiley face. This is just, it's, it's beautiful, beautiful. This is the one I am most excited about. I cannot, What the heck? Are you... I have just read that. Drill not included. Are you kidding? I thought I was getting a mini drill. Like what the heck? It did not say, I swear online it did not say drill not included. You cannot put a picture of a drill and not include the drill. So basically, ladies and gentlemen, I bought a toilet brush head, a very expensive toilet brush head. <laughs> this is a joke and a half. I mean, I did get a lot more heads than I thought, but seriously, I thought I was getting a little drill and I was gonna go around the place and drill stuff. Okay, so basically what I've bought is uh, a toilet brush head with an Allen key on the end. I know that's not an Allen key, but you know, it's an Allen key kind of fitting, isn't it? Is it? I don't know. I'm not a builder. Should we look through them? How exciting. It's not really. I've got two different toilet head brushes. If this is the length of the connection, my hand's gonna be here, down, like, is this for cleaning a toilet? Because I don't think I want to clean a toilet. Ooh, ooh, fancy. Do you know what? They thought of it. They thought of it. They've given me a mini extension. So I can pop this in here and then I'll be further away from the bottom of the toilet. Shh. Although I don't know whose toilet is that dirty that you need a power scrubber to clean because wow. Okay, so I've got two of these medium sized little round head, a big size round head. I've got two little diddy baby ones and I also have, oh wow. Oh, I'm excited to use this. I also, oh. How does this one go in? This one's a little Allen key, as are all of them. This is a little round, what is that and why is it different? Wear eye protection. Don't know how I feel about using this one. That's a little bit scary, isn't it? That you have to wear eye protection to use it. Might leave that one. Definitely testing this one. These, they look a little fancy, don't they? They're quite nice, they've got little ridges. Do you know what those ridges do? Those ridges catch every little speck of shampoo and conditioner and shower gel and everything else that comes off your body. It just lays on the ridges. And then when it comes to cleaning, it's a job. Luckily not my job, it's Nick's job, but if this can help him out, he can use it. I'm happy to let him use my little this thing. We're gonna see if this can get it off. Come here, let me show you. That's not bad at all. That works pretty well. I think Nick's gonna be really happy with this when I give him this for his birthday. <sighs> Okay, so that is it for today's video. I really, really do hope you enjoyed. If you did, give this video a thumbs up. It really helps me out. And I will see you guys very, very soon. Bye.